yeah third point is the uh, if in if in prime factorization of any number each factor appears three times then the number is a perfect cube we learned about cube but now perfect cube means uh, uh, if uh, uh, let's say uh, let's say this number 64 if it is perfect or not then you have to like we learned in previous that uh, you can make a divide by these prime numbers the prime numbers is like 2 3 5 7 11 like that so you start with first one like 64 divided by 2, it becomes 32. You divide by 2 again, 16, 2, 8, 2, 4, 2, uh, 2, 2, 1. So, and so now, like in square, we have to make a pair of 3. And I, I think uh, up to here. So, 1, 2, 3. This is one pair, so 2 raised to 3 times, this is another uh, 3, pair of 3, so 2 raised to 3. So, uh, if you like that, so if you want to cube root, then you have to just take two numbers, this 3 pair like that. So, if you say 2 times 2 equal to 4. So, this is the cube root. If you do write that, it becomes 64. So this is the same method like we learned for square, that any number if you uh, factorize a prime number, uh, factor means uh, in a factor, two, 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 two. So, but if you divide that number with prime numbers, and if you make a pair of three of each number, and if it is a, a all in a pair, then it will be perfect square, perfect cube. So that's just the definition.